Before any canvas goes out the door here, uh, we always finish it with a UV coating or, or varnish. We use Breathing Colors Glamour 2. Uh, it comes in either gloss or matte. In order to do this, we've built a uh, spray booth that looks like a reverse hockey table. Here you can see me turning on the variable fan speed uh, controller. Um, this sucks the canvas to the pegboard here. It's got air channels in the back. <clears throat> and um, it also helps clear the air of the, of the spray as you're doing it. We've also got intake and outlet fans on the sides, and all of these have filters on them, so we're not releasing a bunch of dust or spray out into the air outside. There's the room. Um, it's a nice finish area. You can see here I'm plugging in the gun. It's an HVLT sprayer. And as we spray the canvas, we're very careful to um, spray consistently and evenly. Um, you want to go back and forth and up and down and look at it from different angles so um, you get an even coating. We've tried foam roll coaters, um, and we do still use them occasionally. Um, we also have a liquid laminator, but we keep going back to the spray gun here and our spray booth because we get such a consistent and even coating on our canvas and it's much easier to control the thickness um, uh, the thickness of the coating when we're applying it and uh, we, we just don't have any problems with streaking and the other problems that are associated with, uh, with the roller. It is a little bit of a commitment you can see we've built quite a little contraption here um, but we think it gives us uh, really good results and um, once you've got a setup like this it's it's very easy to go in and spray a couple of canvases there's very little setup and tear down you can usually leave spray in the gun for a couple of days we we clean it really well every couple of days but otherwise it's low maintenance and uh there you have it that's how we finish our canvases here